Hi, welcome to Nerd Culture. I'm Amon Gutierrez. Uh, today we're with Ricky Fang. And uh, here at NerdCon, uh, you see a lot of anime and you see a lot of cartoonings and you don't see a lot of combination of, of the two. Uh, Ricky, how do you feel about anime coming to the States when we were kids? Uh, I'd say it, it was a very much a, a fresh feeling because what happens is uh, when we first saw like Dragon Ball Z, Sailor Moon and stuff like that, it, it was crazy because, you know, cartoons weren't over the top like, like Dragon Ball Z. So when we first saw that, it was crazy. We all loved it and, you know, we got all hyped for it. Yeah. yeah. So for your, um, for your art style, you incorporate a lot of cartooning with anime, mm -hmm. um, kind of when do you decide to go more anime eyes or more cartoon eyes? Um, I'm not exactly sure. I have my own style of eyes. It's like usually people they describe it as being like triangular shape. It's, it's like uh, I don't really like to do the big, you know, the big anime eyes, like the cutesy eyes, because personally I just think that's a little too much for the eye pupils. So I just keep it small and simple, but at the same time they're sizable to, you know, look as if it's anime in a way. Oh, sure. mm -hmm. And then. Um, so what would you say is your favorite genre or piece that you like to work on the most? Uh, my favorite genre piece, uh, I would say a lot would have to do probably do um, funny fan art or you know a lot of the pinups I like to do. Cool. And uh, where can people go see you to either buy your stuff or see your stuff? Um, usually I'm, I'm on DeviantArt a lot. I'm on also Tumblr, which I don't really use. I recently got out on um, Instagram as well. And, uh, I only have a, I have a store, I have store envy, and it's just hooks and fangs. I only sell shirts there currently. I will probably sell other things later on. That sounds great. This is Nerd Culture. Thanks a lot, Ricky. We'll see you next time.